Hi everyone, this is Jackie. Welcome to my channel and thank you all for coming back and watching my videos and subscribing. I really do appreciate that. Today I want to share with you a card project that I made yesterday. And um, the reason I, I didn't videotape it was because I was just so tired and I just needed to get some rest. Um, excuse the noise in the background, it's just the TV. Um, but um, so I used, um, actually I used one pad to make this whole card. I used uh, this pad here, which I bought from um, Target, and forgive me for the glare. It was three dollars, so I bought it, and it's from American Crafts. And I really liked the pattern papers inside, that's why I bought it, especially that one. That one really caught my eye. And they have beautiful pattern papers inside here, as you can see. So, um, the majority of this card is made using just this one pad. So, um, I used only a, a white piece of a, well, the card base is the white uh, glimmer sh uh, paper, cardstock, and then I cut out this part here, and I made it look like if there was a snow bank there, and then I die cut the trees using the same paper pad right there, that same, that paper pad, uh, pattern right there. I cut out three trees using this die set right here from uh, Artc. So I used that, and then for the reindeers, I used this die over here as well, using the same paper. Well, not the same paper, but another paper from this pad. And with that, I added some glossy accents just to give it a little shine to the to the reindeers and then I, I added a uh, spectrum noir uh, clear marker pen to give the, the trees a little shine to it and then I stamped it using the uh, hero arts um, um, message or sentiment I'm not sure what the title of this one is but it's from hero arts and these are all the sentiments so I used this one right here thinking of you at Christmas and um, and I just added another little extra strip of uh, the black snowflake uh, cardstock so that's it for my finished project right there I hope everybody likes it um, I also like to share with you um, I have a shop on Etsy in which I make uh, I sell cards and other trinkets and I had a customer who bought a card from me and um, I thought it was a cute card I mean it, it had owls and you know and it was a Spanish card I made it uh, a Spanish card and the lady who bought it um, gave a review of uh, the card and Basically, she called the card cheap uh, because of the sentiment. Um, the sentiment wasn't stamped like this one here. Uh, it wasn't a stamped sentiment. It was a sentiment that I had printed out on the computer on a copy paper, and uh, I just adhered it, glued it onto the uh, cardstock. Apparently, she thought that was cheap, and she didn't like it very much. Um, so that got me a little bit down and I'm, I, I understand that everybody has their own opinions but um, I didn't let it get to me too much because um, out of all the sales that I've had and uh, the 44 reviews that I've had um, including hers I've only had one negative remark so but I just uh, I didn't reach out I did write to her back and I told her um, that um, thank you for the constructive criticism but um, 
as it is it, it is a handmade card so not everything you know not every card is gonna come out perfect so um but uh, but I will try my best to make it better in the future so um but it's hard to uh find any stamps out there in Spanish so um so I, I, I look up for sentiments in uh, the computer and then I print them out. So um, so that was it. So I just wanted to share that out there with you. Um, if you think that my card looks cheap at all, I mean, let me know in the comments below if there's anything that I could do to make my card better. Let me know in the comments below. And uh, that's it. So, um, so that's it. So I'll be linking my uh, Etsy shop on the, on the link below if you'd like to go and check it out. And uh, you have yourselves a great evening. Enjoy the rest of the night. And stay warm because it is very, very cold. And uh, until next time, happy crafting.